February 7th, 2023, I get a pretty regular looking email. It's an email from a company asking for a sponsorship. But in this case, the company is Sandbox. That's a massive brand, so I get excited. But one thing strikes me odd, it's that they ask me to download some exe file and run it on my system. Now that is a red flag, because running a random executable file could do anything. It can hijack my YouTube session and hack my channel. That's exactly how that Tesla fake live stream happens on those hacked channels. But here's the thing, the files they sent were completely safe and scanned by Gmail without any issues. Thankfully I didn't fall for it, but if only there was a better solution, you know. Wow, really? This is what we're doing? A TikTok t-shirt transition? Come on. Anyway, SquareX does have the answer to our problem. In case you don't know what SquareX is, it's a free browser extension which you can install that gives you tons of cybersecurity features. And the latest one of their features is this malicious document scanner for emails. Let's do a test, shall we? They provided me a sussy file and I'll send it to myself and open it regularly. And the message seems pretty innocent too. Seems like it's from an employer and they are asking me to download this file. And apparently they had to rename this as PDF for security reasons. I mean, sure, that sounds like a decent reason. I mean, Gmail says it's fine, it's scanned for malicious code and it's okay, and it seems like a regular PDF, let's download this. Should be fine, right? No. no, wrong. You see, the reason why they ask you to change it to an XLSM format is because they have included some macros in there. That macro can execute a certain command that can launch an app or do something without your knowledge. And by turning it into PDF while sending through an email, they manage to avoid any spam filters or any automatic detections like this Gmail scan. You saw how easy it is to bypass it, right? Scanned by Gmail is no longer sufficient evidence for a safe file. Okay, then let's enable these smart integrations for scanning these malicious code in Gmail. As soon as I've enabled that in the extension, you can see it has flagged that file. Regular Gmail couldn't catch it, this one did. And now that I can see that this attachment is kinda sus, I can open that in a secure window that opens in a cloud environment. It doesn't open anything on your PC. So whatever infectious creepiness that file had will not come to your PC at all. You can browse it there, see exactly what data was in it, and if you wish, you can download it after that. Or you can simply copy the raw data outside of it without any extra code. That that essentially eliminates the chance of any macros being present. All of this is part of that same free extension by the way. Squarex also has a disposable browser so you can open it, connect to any of those VPNs and browse the web in that secure container. And as I mentioned it works on any chromium based browser so you can just install it and see for yourself. There's nothing to lose so download it from the link in the description and let me know what you think.